doesn't love a little extreme science this early in the morning? It is time now to imagine it. We're here with the chief scientist from the Imagination Station, Carl Nelson. Carl, I see a balloon over there. There is a balloon. Yeah. We're going to do a little combustion. Okay. okay. This is one of our favorite demonstrations where we talk about the three things you need for combustion, fuel, flame, and oxygen. All right. Now, that balloon is filled with a fuel. I'm going to have you put your safety glasses on. I knew it was coming. We've got a flame here. There's oxygen in the air. I just want you to snuggle this flame up to the bottom of the balloon. <laughs> snuggle. And just bring it in there, let the flame melt the balloon, and let's just see what happens. Bring it up. Yeah. Okay. Opa! <laughs> so that was hydrogen gas. <laughs> now that looked like it was a crazy explosion, right? It, it felt like it too. <laughs> We've got high speed footage on our website. I'll provide a link for that. Um, when What you just did was you melted the side of the balloon when that flame came nearby. The balloon, which is under tension, peels away. Mm -hmm. The hydrogen gas inside is lighter than air, begins to move upward, mixing with oxygen in the air, and then it slowly begins to combust. Wow. Okay. So that's cool, but I want to take it up another notch. I want to actually mix the oxygen with the hydrogen so there's no delay in, in, in the detonation. We want to get okay. right to the combustion. We want to get right to combustion. And in order to do that, here's what we're going to do. I've got a tray of water here. We're going to put some dish soap in the water. We're going to make bubbles filled with a mixture of hydrogen and oxygen gas. That is what is in this balloon right here. Now, I'm going to make bubbles. You're going to scoop up those bubbles with your bare hands. Mm -hmm. Then I'm going to ignite them with this lighter. And not ignite the hair on my arms. Correct. And so what you're going to do first is you're actually going to dip your hands. So you're probably going to have to put the mic down for yeah. this. But you're going to dip your hands into the water. Get your arms, you know, any hair you want to keep on your arms, you're going to want to get wet. OK. You're going to get wet. I'm going to make some bubbles then. And then we will go ahead and do the detonation. Well, here, why don't you tell people about the hours today while I soap up? OK. We are open 10 to 5 on Saturdays and Lucas County residents 12 and under get in free with a paid adult admission. We got lots of really cool demonstrations happening all day long like this as part of our combustion show. And I don't know, you can probably hold that gen gingerly. I think I might get electrocuted, but I'm no, all right. You'll be fine. So okay. now we're going to make bubbles. Again, these are hydrogen and oxygen gas bubbles. What I'm going to have you do once I get, I want to get a lot in here, okay? Because if you're going to do this, you may as well go big. I want you to grab as many bubbles as you can, but leave the water behind. I think I'll, put I need the, I'll put those on your head. Don't okay. worry. We'll have time here. And I'm going to put some <laughs> on too, because this uh, detonation is actually a supersonic detonation. It's going to be loud. It's going to be fast. It's going to be bright and the look on your face will be priceless when you see what actually happens. So here we go, some hearing protection for you. Is that good? It's good. Okay. My ears are pretty big, so I'm glad these are All really right. big. I'm going to scoop this up. I'm going to let you go ahead and scoop up some bubbles, both hands, as many as you can. Perfect. Open your hands, flatten them up a little bit. That seems like a lot. Let's, get, let's tone it down a bit. <laughs> Move over there a little bit. We're going to do a countdown from three, two, one. Okay, even with the earmuffs. <laughs> Crazy. Crazy. That went right up my sinuses, like jumping into a pool Absolutely. without plugging my nose. <laughs> and, and, and here's a towel for you. Here's a towel for you. And that's what happens when you mix the oxygen with the hydrogen, right? Uh huh. So again, one of the things we kind of do during our combustion demonstration at the Science Center, come down and check it out. We also talk about fire safety as well. There you go. Yes. Do not try this at yeah, home. Don't try it at home. It's not like you can acquire hydrogen easily, though. So, no, not really. Know. All right. Well, that's what you get when you combine <laughs> Carl with science and you imagine it. <laughs>